morning good morning from my bed <laughs> it is saturday morning and i really wish that i can sleep a little bit longer but i can't um i have so much to do um today my skin is breaking out so bad like my skin has been doing well for the longest time um whenever i would get a breakout it would be like one or two breakouts but i would be able to control it and now this week it's just all over and then you're underneath as well so my skin is just breaking out so bad currently in the bed um still i am literally just <laughs> taking my time to wake up this morning um a slow morning zachary is up already he's the inside being busy um so good to just have him home yo my heart so good to just have him home i want to make a nice um breakfast for the two of us but i needed um some honey um and then i was craving some shoulder bacon as well so I just put in a pick and pay order just now so the order will probably be here in an hour from now um i am going to wake up and then give him something light to eat um, i really want to make myself a smoothie but my blender the motor of my blender broke so i'm still waiting on russell's to email me back regarding that um yeah so i think i'll just grab like a banana or something go to the gym quickly and then i'm sure by the time or maybe i'll just wait for my pick and pay order first because i need to drink some coffee as well my leafy made me some coffee this morning but we have no sugar and we have no honey also in the house and i just need my coffee to be like i only drink one sugar um yeah so i just need my coffee to taste like my coffee and not butter you know what i mean so yeah um i think i'll just wait out um just wait out for my coffee tidy up a little bit um put my gym clothes on wait for the pick and pay order pack everything out and then make myself a good cup of coffee near a honey diet <laughs> and then i am going to wait for the pick and pay order and then i'm going to go my coffee and then i'm going to enjoy my coffee and then i really want to read um my bible as well this morning so i'm going to dedicate some time unto god before the day gets crazy crazy I'm going to dedicate some time unto God and then only I'm going to tidy up a thin sewing zip it, get into my gym clothes and then go to the gym and then only when we come back from the gym I really want to make a nice um, breakfast for me and Zachary, my leaf is at work um, and I want to try the rolled oats, banana and egg pancakes i haven't tried them before and i really want to try them out today i wanted to make them for the longest time um so i think it's just going to work perfect like pancakes and bacon and um strawberries yeah yes so i am going to do that but i'll give him something just to nibble on for the morning maybe like a small bowl of cereal just for him to have a layer in his tummy because he's going to the gym with me but we are doing the last saturday or the last winter saturday we are about a week and a half out from no about a week two weeks i don't know a week or two weeks out let me just, let me just see let me just see let me just see we are yeah it's about a week and a half 
out from it being spring in South Africa so this is going to be my last winter morning routine and yeah um I'm happy that winter is over I am ready for spring to come I am ready for the summer to come as well I'm definitely a summer baby um I love the summer I love the heat I love my feet open and I think this summer I would like to wear a lot of dresses as well this summer and spring season so I'm looking forward to the summer um so yeah let's enjoy this last winter morning where I can just have a have a lazy morning you know like all my mornings also go 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 and I thought because I have this Saturday open let me just have a lazy last winter morning um and that is exactly what i'm going to do i also want to remove my nails today so i want to do that and then i want to do my toes as well today um because my feet already are getting so hot and i can already feel my feet wants to be open they want to be in sloffies they want to be in open shoes they just they just they just want to be open already and my toes are winter toes <laughs> my toes are clean though like there's nothing on them like bef when the winter started i just took all my acrylics off and I just cleaned them out and I would just cut them throughout the whole winter. That's what I did. So they are clean, um, but they're not spring worthy, you know. They're also not summer worthy. They're also not open shoes worthy. So I really want to do that today. Big and bear. All right, what are you doing? What are you doing? Big and bear delivered in 45 minutes. They were like... Sign seal delivered, I'm yours. Dun, 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 Okay, let's unpack everything. Do a quick grocery haul. Because, uh, okay. Got some strawberry yogurt. Got some strawberries as well. Um, got some broccoli because I really want to make some rice bowls as well. Um, got the honey that I needed. And then got some sugar as well. And then what's in here? Okay. Then that's still delivered. Got some sweet corn as well. Got some diced bacon and then got some shoulder bacon as well. So I'm going to use the shoulder. Going to use the shoulder bacon today. And then the diced bacon. We are going to use on another day. Yeah. <laughs> okay, um, let me all this weg pack and then can I coffee mark because for a coffee I've been awake more than two hours and I have not had a cup of coffee and that that is illegal that's illegal so let me pack everything away and then I can have some coffee grab a banana get into my gym clothes and then go to the gym as well it is just before 10 so yeah it's a bit light um, but yeah there's still a nice cool morning breeze outside and I really just want to get that morning workout in today. So let's do that. Sun still delivered, I'm yours. Sun still delivered, I'm yours.
but I am just busy tidying up a little bit and I am just getting so emotional like I'm just thinking um like I I'm busy tidying up now and let me just say like where the emotion is coming from so I'm busy tidying up and now I am deciding okay am I going to do my Bible study now or am I going to do my Bible study after coming from the gym so I decided okay I'm going to do my Bible study after coming from the gym because I really want to take a shower as well and I want to wash out my braids as well sorry my face looks crazy I didn't wash my face last night I literally just used a makeup wipe so if you see if you just you know what okay okay anyway um and i decided okay i'm going to do my bible study um when i come from the gym because i really want to wash my hair i really want to wash up my braids and i'm gonna have to sit outside on the balcony for my hair to get dry right and while i'm sitting um i can use that time to do my bible study instead of wanting to cram it in now before i go to the gym because i really want to do a thorough bible study today right um and Upon deciding now that I'm going to do my Bible study later on, um, I just started praying. I'm like, okay, I'm going to do Bible study Bible study later on, but I, I just feel like I still want to just, you know, connect with God, like, in the morning. Um, and I just started, you know, saying thank you. I just started... Um, praying basically as I'm busy tidying up, you know, just being appreciative of where I am currently um, spiritually, you get? Um, and how I have grown and um, I'm looking at my little human being and I'm just so grateful and I'm just so happy that um, it's Saturday morning and he's home with me and um, I'm just loving on him and thanking God, you know, for his life and for um, granting me this amazing opportunity to even be his mom. Like, it's insane to say it, but like, I have a son and he's five years of age and he's growing up so, 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 so much. And I just love him, right? And while I am just packing away my clothes, I... Um, just while I'm not praising and praising God and being happy and just saying thank you to God. Thank you. It's such a thank you prayer this morning, right? And um, I just realized that I'm starting to heal from my miscarriage that I had, you know, about eight months ago. Um, almost eight months ago. I'm starting to really and genuinely heal from, from that hurt. Um, and I just said thank you to God you know I just I just thank God for that as well like I'll obviously never ever forget it but a couple of months ago just thinking about what happened it was so heavy um, I would find myself crying and sobbing um, whenever I'm driving and just thinking about it I would find myself so sad and so heartbroken and with all these questions in my mind and um, I just I just started thanking God, you know, because I'm really starting to heal. Like, I'm really starting to heal. I just thought about it, and all I could say is, God, thank you. Thank you for holding me. Thank you for keeping me. Thank you for um, putting each... Thank you for, for, for each day that has passed and that I... I'm still here and that just thank thank you for the strength you know to just continue with life and thank you for the child that I do have you know that is alive you know that 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 you gave to me thank you for that you know thank you for um Thank you for the fact that I am not taking the fact that you made me a mom already for granted. And I'm just, I'm just, I'm just so grateful. I'm just so grateful. I'm just, I'm just so grateful in this moment. I'm just, just so, so, so grateful. And yeah, I just thought that I needed to share that um, with you guys this morning. Um... God is really good. God is really good. And um, I'm just really happy. I'm just really happy and content with, 
with finally, with finally being, um, being a, 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 a proud Christian. And the reason why I say this is because, um, when I was younger, I was always ashamed of being a Christian and, um, although my friends would always, you know, see that I am a Christian because I never, like, listen to any other music. I've always just listened to, you know, gospel music and, um, church has always been important to me and the word of God has always been important to me and I think the fact that I am so intentional about, um, starting to read the word of God and wanting to understand God's word and wanting to understand um, God and wanting to just draw close to him, you know, in all ways, shape and form, you know, and not to be ashamed about it. You know, I'm young, I'm in my 20s and I'm not ashamed about it. I'm not ashamed about it. Like the world doesn't, it doesn't, it doesn't, it doesn't, interest me anymore you know i i don't feel like i need to i need to do this because i'm young i need to do this to fit in i need to do this um than what honey means to see you know things like that like i'm just at a point where it is not yeah no it is not it is not it is not it you know what i mean like yeah it is not by a by a by a by a content at this moment with god with jesus with with growing um yeah yeah it's just such a good morning it's such a good morning the season is definitely changing we are going into spring season um and i can just give all the glory i can just give all praises unto god because god is a god of God is a God of, of healing. He's a God of, of, of safekeeping. He's a God of protection. He's a God of, um, he's a restoring God. You know, he's a renewal God. Yeah, dear Azira. Okay, we are in the car on our way to gym. I... I'm just going to make a few um, stops. I need to go to the nail shop because I need some nail products. And then I need to go to spa as well because I just saw that I ran out of shower gel as well. And I was thinking just to get a scrub as well. I really want to do a nice and thorough shower today. Um because I just saw my armpits and I need to shave so I need to do that as well so I really just want to do a nice and thorough shower when I come back um, from the gym and I was thinking to go to like to run my errands after after the gym session but then I was like no I'm gonna be sweaty and stinky and uncomfortable being around people so I am going to run my errands now before I go to the gym while I'm still fresh and I look like a proper human being and then I know after gym I can just come back straight home and then enjoy a nice shower. So let's go to the gym and get in a good workout for the day. literally longer. I thought that I was going to take a shower first um, before making breakfast but they are now here I am very very hungry so let's start with breakfast immediately um, that workout session was really really good today I did a 5k um, yeah so it was it was nice um, obviously still very slow because I'm only getting back into the swing of things now only but yeah that was um it was really good being at the gym this morning, but it is, um, my sinuses are still bothering me though. Just a little softer please baby. Thank you. My sinuses are still bothering me though. Um, 
So let me start with breakfast now and then I can just drink a Sinucon and then <sighs> take a shower. Want ik is bij honger. Ik is bij bij honger. Ik is honger gym. Letterlijk. So let's start with breakfast. Okay, I got all my ingredients out. I have my oats and then my banana, cinnamon and then baking powder as well and just some regular milk as well and then I knew I wasn't supposed to go in by clicks because I knew I was going to forget something I actually wanted to go to spa because on my list was some vanilla as well so now I'm not going to have vanilla in and I really wanted to buy some almond milk as well but regular milk is going to have to do um just took some eggs out as well because for some reason I'm craving eggs right now and then have my bacon out and then my strawberries as well so let's start with this breakfast delicious and healthy banana oat pancakes. They're quick and easy to make and let me show you how. For a single serving, I start with one very ripe banana. You can double or triple this recipe. Then I go in with rolled oats or oatmeal, half a cup, and then one egg and a splash of almond or any dairy-free milk. Next, add one teaspoon of baking powder to help it rise and also some cinnamon for a good flavor. I also love to add vanilla, but I was out. A little bit of salt to taste and you just blend that up. This is going to be the end of this video. I literally took the best shower of my entire life. I am just going to put some makeup on my face just so that I can look like a proper human being for the rest of the day. I washed out my braids as well and my scalp just feels nice and clean and refreshed as well. Um, if you have watched this whole entire video, I love you so, 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 so much. Up until next time, I love you guys.